video, I got 50 YouTubers to go against 50 miners. Whoever is the last one to touch a mine. I mean, Mr. Jimmy, it's not a bad idea. We all know by now you only care about views and money. Might as well go for it. One out of 10 videos. The highest breaking vi video on your... It will surpass even Squid Games. 100% 1 billion views guaranteed. Imagine he actually came up with the idea, told to his manager and his production team, and they all too had to like stare at him and just debunk the whole shit, shut it down. Just like when he was about to promote scamming websites to his audience, knowing that it was a scam website. And I, I had to talk him back on it. I was like, listen, we're not promoting gambling. I think people are going to see this negatively. Now, as most of you are aware, there's no escape from it on the internet and you cannot get enough of it just like you clicked on this video. Mr. Jimmy's bestie, Mr. Ava, two weeks ago got exposed for liking and buying a cartoon character, a child in that cartoon, having spicy pictures and was having public conversations with the dark web artist as well. That is when people started throwing more evidence into that fire, fueling it, and it started fucking exploding. Second stage came with 500,000 Discord messages leaked between Mr. Ava, 2021 20, years old, back in 2017, having spicy conversations with the 13, 14 year olds. And a few days later, Mr. Ava gave out a statement and just a day after that mr jimmy gave out his statement saying oh my god i had no idea that this person was doing this i spent i grew up with this guy we even lived together i know every single thing i even know which position he is even curved at but i had no idea that this person was this disturbing and disgusting i can't believe it you think you know people guys right right then all of us we were like all right that's about it that's a wrap mr jimmy's not bringing mr ava in his videos anymore he is fired from mr beast videos now mr beast videos are actually going to be detaining and not wanting to make people click off the second mr ava shows up in the video we all thought okay it's a wrap guys take it easy it was, it's been fun this is the drama that's about it right wrong that is when a 19 year old dog pack mr woke up and chose violence that day he joined mr b's team thinking the whole shit is rigged and he can join in the games and he, if he overreacts he can win those five hundred thousand dollar prizes but he was fired after a month for being a lousy worker so he decided to you know what if i'm not winning it no one's making any money anymore he decided to burn the whole ship down that's when he made a fucking 50 minute video just exposing mr jimmy of exposing gambling to kids having the whole thing rigged nothing is true do not believe your eyes and mr beast doesn't care about the blind the plastic and the sea and the turtle so i am absolutely pigging out on feastables um and i'm trying to do this mr beast is teaching us gambling minus points because there's no cool music anyway uh, let's gamble. And then fast forward, it was revealed that uh, Jimmy knew about Mr. Ava's past and he was part of it as well. But he was just uh, burying Mr. Ava and he was he didn't want to be aside with him anymore. And right after that, Mr. B's team threatened to sue this dog pack guy and there's still no updates about the situation. But one update that we got about this whole situation, the reason I made the video is because of few things. Just yesterday, Mr. Beast dropped this video. And honestly, this whole thing being such a big controversy, such a big drama, literally the whole page is just filled with this. You know, this has to be probably the biggest controversy in the past five to 10 years, I would say. You would expect dislikes and a lot of comments confronting Mr. Beast and confronting the whole situation, but it was nothing like that. Every single top comment you see, no one is addressing the situation. They're just talking about the video and the people who commented and screen recorded them talk saying that Jimmy, we know your secret, you dirty little secret. He has thousands of those midgets from the chocolate factory sitting down and removing comments one by one. Although also having filters on these comments where like a thousand specific words you say are going to be censored and immediately automatically deleted. But he has people going through it manually as well. Anyone with the slightest thing, oh, we know your secret boom delete and obviously you cannot believe whatever you see on twitter so i decided to go check it out myself talking about the video talking about the video talking about the video talking about the video talking about there is nothing no one addressing anything about the whole situation so i decided to go on the the latest comments and see what's happening last four minutes good video wow so cool 
now I can finally enjoy the content again. I want to be in a video. Sevenda incredible video. I've been working on my Spanish for the past couple of months. This is what he said. Hello, Mr. Beast. Nothing, nothing. And the last comments are what? Four minutes ago, you're telling me a video with 89 million views? There is at least 40 to 50 comments each minute coming through this video. Minimum. And honestly, I've been scrolling for the past 10 minutes and not even a single comment is addressing the situation. Either this 81,000 people commented are paid actors or they're playing with Mr. Beast balls to be able to have a chance to win a million dollars like Mr. Beast promised everyone who subscribes gets a thousand dollars or you have a chance to win like a Bugatti or something. It's either that or the whole 90 million people who watch this video. They're that one friend who has absolutely no idea what is going on around the world or even their surroundings are lost in the social media bubble and they keep on watching stupid shit. But honestly, anyone with a brain cell and knows how YouTube works is you can obviously go in your settings and filter specific words. Mr. B scams people? Block! Mr. Ava tickling children? Block! Mr. B tickling children? Block! Every single thing that even the slightest is, you know, is like related to the drama is being filtered and is being blocked. And the second thing people started talking about is the dislike section. There's a couple of pictures going viral all over the internet. First one being saying that this video, Mr. Beast video, has 1.5 million dislikes. Even Drama Alert posted saying that it has 500,000 dislikes, but then they apologize saying that we've been using a third-party app to show YouTube's dislike. It's been a very inaccurate app, and we apologize for this misinformation. I use the same app as well. The second I opened the page, I don't know if you noticed it or not, but it said it has one 1.9 million dislikes. Now, I do believe that this third app is inaccurate because I went and I tested on my own videos as well. And in my Dr. Disrespect video that I made last night, today I opened it up and I opened up the video. It said 300 dislikes. I was like, what the fuck? Did I, was I asleep when I made this video? Was I sleepwalking? Was I protecting Dr. Disrespect in some way that I didn't even realize that it's getting so many dislikes because it had only 100 something likes. But then I went through my YouTube analytics and I checked it had only like, I don't know, 7, 8, 9, 10 dislikes. And I, that's the time I realized, okay, this third party app is not accurate. They can lie to you. Usually it's not that far off. For example, if you have 21 dislikes, it might show 30 dislikes. But in some cases, in this case, for example, sometimes it can go drastic. For example, I had 100 something likes on my old video and, you know, I opened it up. It says 300 dislikes, even though it had only seven or eight. So in this situation, this is just going drastically up. And even Keemstar posted a video saying that, you know, they had to reach out to Mr. Beast to verify it and see how much dislikes uh, the Mr. Beast latest video has. And this is what it said. It said it has 3 million likes and only 37,000 uh, dislikes, keeping it at 98.2%. My best guess is those 3 million people who liked and the rest of the 80 something million people who watched the video, they probably don't give a shit about this whole situation. They probably don't know that Mr. Beast is through this controversy because majority of people don't even open up Twitter. They don't even have Twitter. Only the 37,000 people who dislike, like us, me and you, we are addicted to that nicotine called drama. We are the only one who are aware of these situations and the rest, they don't probably care. They watch movies, they know they're actors and they see Mr. Beast as an actor, as an internet personality as well. And they don't really give a shit. They just want to watch the video and eat their food. But removing people's comments and filtering it is just making things worse. If the fire was this big it's now this big and for sure with this pr strategy that they've been going forward with going absolutely quiet and just trying to suppress everyone the fire is going to be in the next month 100 this big and the next month this big and then you know the fire goes up the reason i think why chris cody co uh jimmy why they haven't come clean about the whole situation saying i apologize this was me but it was never my intention and you know i just had inappropriate conversations with a minor and i've been faking my videos and exploding gambling to children and just rigging the whole thing i don't actually care about the people i care about money more and i've been playing a character all along you fools i almost ran out of breath over there the reason why i think they're not coming forward and making a statement is because dr disrespect took the first shot by coming clean to everyone and he absolutely got sunk so everyone thought okay guys not a not a good idea 
Let's just ghost. Let's code code this shit by DJing our uh, ourselves through with this drama into silence, and we will get away with it. All we have to do is not talk about it. And Doctor Disrespect being so f mad for being the first person to take a shot on how to handle this whole situation. This just end Mr. Jimmy's situation just got spicier. The YouTuber with 14.5 million subscribers who spoke against Mr. Beast on exposed Mr. Beast on certain things like not providing food and water and just treating the contestants like absolute shit. She came forward and posted this yesterday saying, Jimmy's production team took every contestant's underwear and medicine from them for some weird reasons. They were told they would given back each night to change, but they were not. Multiple female contestants messaged me saying that Miss Beast game still has her underwear. Disgusting. Miss Rosanna, you cannot leave us like that. You need to give us the reason on why they took your underwear in the first place. What was the reason that you even ag agreed to give your underwear? I mean, to be fair, $500,000, if they tell me to take my underwear off and give it to them, they can keep it. But they said they'll give you new ones. Are they supposed to wash the underwear and give it back? Or, you know, you'll be getting a new one with Mr. Beast logo on it or your own and you they'll wash your own and give it back to you? I have no idea. Honestly, this whole thing should have come, come with more context, but this just dropped in. Maybe in my next video, it is going to be Mr. Beast's underwear situation was crazy. Something like that I'll probably go for. Or Mr. Beast steals panties from his cont cont contestants. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck I'm going to go for. But you'll know it's my video the second you read the title. Now, I don't know how verified this is. I don't know if this is true or not. Because she just came and dropped that without any verification, I would say. I don't know if I should believe this Rosanna or not. But the last claims was believable. But this one, I still need verification. The woman needs to come forward and talk about it. Anyways, this whole situation just keeps on getting worse. If I tell you the last video, like the last video on the last video I told you, I'll be lying. Because fire is growing day by day and... I just, I'm so invested. I'm so fucking invested in this drama and I look forward to whatever happens next. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video, give it a like. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Like, subscribe, you know the rest. I'll catch you at the next one.